Hello, my name is Steve Pickett, and today's reading is from the book of Luke, chapter 2, verses 8 through 12. And there were shepherds living out in the fields nearby, keeping watch over their flocks at night. An angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them. And they were terrified, but the angel said to them, Do not be afraid. I bring you good news of great joy that will be for all the people. Today in the town of David, a Savior has been born to you. He is Christ the Lord. This will be a sign unto you. You will find a baby wrapped in cloths and lying in a manger. So we know that shepherds had several important tasks to feed, lead, and protect. They were supposed to stay quiet and alert and listen out for animals that might harm their sheep. In the same way, the Bible calls for us to be quiet and still and on guard. Jesus is the good shepherd, and he desires to, desires to lead us, guide us, nourish us, and protect us. But we have to slow down and be more intentional with our time and our focus. The shepherds had no choice but to be alert and to be still, or they would wake up with fewer sheep. Let's practice to be more like the shepherds and see how God moves in our lives. And now let's go to the Lord in prayer. Heavenly Father, we are so grateful to you for being the good shepherd. We know that you desire to be near to us. We know that you desire to lead us and nourish us every day. Lord, we just pray that we would be still and we would be calm and we would go to you and, and let you do all the things you desire to do. The maker of the heavens and the universe who, who came down from heaven to earth as a baby who was crucified on the cross for our sins is alive and he's near and he is the good shepherd. And we are so grateful for you, Jesus. And especially during this Advent season, we just desire to be more like you and to have more time with you in our daily lives. Amen. Amen.